started becoming a cheapskate probably as soon as I moved out of the house. It hit me pretty hard getting my first power bill. I mean, having to shell out $18 just to turn on some lights. I mean, I guess I really had it easy before. There's about three main costs you have every month regardless. And these are ones that you can take a little bit of advantage of. And, uh, and that would be your, your water bill, your power bill, and your laundry bill. Water is a good, good money saving way. I mean, rain falls from the sky. You can drink it. You can use it. Why not utilize it? So I, I tend to run a little water treatment system here. And uh, when it rains, I go out and collect my water, treat it to suitable amount, and, uh, and bottle it and save it for a rainy day. Except for that rainy day is another day of collecting water. We'll test here, and it's showing good. So, I, uh, as a whole, we've kind of implemented a, a plan in order to save electricity. Um, they were a little reluctant at first, but I got most of the roommates to agree that uh, that come ten o'clock, I mean, lights out. It's ten o'clock. He knows the rules. My roommates, they had to be prodded into it. They, uh, they really didn't like it very much. They, uh, it was kind of a three-on-one thing at first. And then we got our first electricity bill, and they realized that they were only paying $4 a month. So, I mean, it's pretty hard to argue with that. We're working a pretty good system around here. We got an accountability system. It's, you know, we got a jar every time you leave a light on put a quarter in the jar and uh, I mean it works both ways one you get a quarter when someone leaves a light on and uh, two the guy isn't gonna leave the power on any longer than he has to because he doesn't want to be called out for, leave, for leaving a light on so uh, we take all that money that's in the jar at the end of the month and we put it towards our power bill and really I mean it's it's knocking things down pretty good I'm feeling pretty confident about it I think it'll catch on well, there's laundry. You gotta do it. You don't want to be smelly kid. But the ways of getting around laundry, there's ways to do it, but it's probably better left untold. Really don't see why I should have to pay any more than I have to. Some may call me a tightwad or a cheapskate, but really I'm just a frugal man.